There, there was a man who has a monument now in Washington, D.C. That man was a, a neo-Marxist and a socialist and a pastor and a tremendous orator, and his name was Dr. Martin Luther King, Jr. He was wrong on the gospel, and he was wrong on worldview as a liberal Marxist socialist, but he left a tremendous legacy. Among that tremendous legacy is another pastor who bought into his neo-Marxism, who is more of an open Marxist than King ever was, who has identified himself as such, who taught black liberation theology faithfully for a long time. And for 20 years, he taught that neo-Marxist black liberation theology to a man by the name of Barack Obama. And now that man is in the White House doing what his pastor discipled him to do, which was exactly what he saw modeled by the leaders in the generations before him, one of whom now has a monument in Washington, D.C. These things don't happen by accident, and they don't happen overnight. Amen.